everybody, this is Lollipop Boy One MLE here today, and welcome to another episode of Lollipop Speed Art. And we are st doing a very popular queen of Romania. This, that's right, this is Marie of Romania. She was the oldest daughter of Prince Alfred, who became Duke of Edinburgh and Duke of Saxe Coburg and Gotha, and his wife Maria Alexandrovna of Russia the only surviving daughter of Alexander II. So Marie became queen, she was princess of Edinburgh at birth, and she spent years in Kent, Malta, and Coburg, and she was originally supposed to marry King George V, but their mothers did not get along at all. So she married um, Prince Ferdinand of Romania, who was the heir apparent to his uncle, King Carl the First, in 1892, and for several years she was crown princess from 1893 to 1914, and she was very popular with the Romanians. And by the way, with um, my take of Marie, I based it off of two photographs. One is her main photograph of her when she became queen, and the other for her outfit was the outfit she wore from when Nicholas II was coronated as Tsar. So, that's a bit of history right there. So, Marie urged her husband Ferdinand, although they didn't get off well at first, she ur they became um, into a mutual admiration for one another, and they entered into the Triple Entente, and all that stuff, and... Bucharest was occupied by the Central Powers, and Marie and her family took refuge in Moldavia. And she was also a nurse. She took th her three daughters um, to the military hospitals, caring for soldiers. At the end of the war, um, Transylvania, following Bessarabia of Bukovina and Bukovina, they became. With, united with Romania and Marie became Queen of Greater Romania and she attended the Paris Peace Conference and I want to insert a joke here about how President Woodrow Wilson was not impressed with her I will insert I wish I could insert a cipher joke here well son <laughs> but anyways she made a good impression on everybody she was very popular abroad and in Romania. She made, she went to the United States diplomatically and then her son Carl tried to tarnish her good name. Oh my god. And um, after that she passed away from cricosis, um, cirrhosis, and died the next year at 62. And then the communists tried to tarnish her name again saying that she um, basically was like a drunkard and she hosted orgies and all that shit. And then after communists fell in Eastern Europe, Marie's popularity recovered and she was offered as a model of patriotism to the population of Romania. She's remembered for her work as a nurse, but she's also known for her writing and her critically acclaimed acclaimed autobiography and she was also into the arts as well and she's pretty badass even in her head portrait when she was in her 40s which i based her tiara her crown on is basically shows her badassery and most belovedness but anyways she is up on my deviant art and also i hope you enjoyed this and i want to give a special shout out to jane b who's became a regular viewer and don't forget to subscribe follow me on my social medias link down in the description i'll see you next time my loves peace